Hi, this is a brief video about using a library database called Oxford Art Online. This is an excellent resource if you have an assignment where you might be uh, looking at researching visual art or architecture and you want to compare the works of multiple different artists from different time periods. So I'm on the College of Alameda homepage. If you scroll to the library, go to the library homepage. Here you can chat with a librarian, you can search our library catalog, but we're interested in Oxford Art Online, which is a database. So I'm going to click Article Databases. If I scroll down a bit to Arts and Humanities, the second link, Oxford Art Online Grove Art. Here I'm prompted to log in with my College of Alameda ID. This is your Peralta ID and password, so I'll select COA student. So long as you're enrolled in a course at College of Alameda for the current term, you should have access to the library databases. If for some reason you put in your Peralta ID and password and it doesn't work, please contact the librarians and we're more than happy to help troubleshoot for you. And now I'm in Oxford Art Online. So the College of Alameda Library has access to the Grove Dictionary of Art. Unfortunately, we don't have access to Benazit Dictionary of Artists. So let's compare Wikipedia to Oxford Art Online. So here's a entry for Francesco di Valdambrino. He's an Italian sculptor um, from the 14th century. And here's a picture of his work. So I'm going to copy this name, and we'll search Oxford Art Online. So the second entry with the green lock means that we have access to it. So this is from the Grove Art Online. So if I select it. So here's the entry for Francesco di Valdambrino. And it describes an Italian sculptor, some of its works, the years they were created, and the medium, so made polychromed wooden sculptures that were popular at the time in for among Sienese sculptors. You'll see a bibliography, which has other references or sources for about this artist. So you can use these to find other related um, sources. Another name for a bibliography is a works cited list or a reference list. And then it also links to external resources. So if we click some of these links, There are some more pictures of this artist's work. What else can you do with this database? So you can search or browse by field. <clears throat> so if you're looking for African art or art of early Christian Byzantine art, East Asian art, 18th century art, Greek Roman art, you can browse all these categories. You can explore by medium, so what type of art, um, you know, ceramics and pottery, glass, painting and drawing, photography. You can also browse by era, so for any assignments that require you to compare art from different time periods. This is a great way to select different time periods. And then region, countries, or information about particular artists or scholars or collectors. So that's a way to search and to browse for high quality information from Grove Art Online, which is part of Oxford Art Online, which is a library database that you have access to. So I hope that's helpful. As always, 
feel free to reach out to us with any questions. You can chat with the librarian here. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye.